Hello, Medelity here. And uh, tutorials aren't usually my thing, but I hope this helps you because it took me about five hours to figure out how to get this working compared to watching other YouTube videos. So I'm having probably the same issue you are where I bring in a clip from uh, you know, from my media pool to my timeline and DaVinci Resolve. And for some reason, my waveform is green and it's just not showing me any of my talking. It'll play back perfectly fine and tell me that there is audio, but it won't show me the waveform. Now, what I've looked at through forums and finally through YouTube videos, I realized I'd have to click on this that says no input and click on input and then click on one of these and then click on all these, right? And then press patch, right? and then it will show up magically. That was not working. It would just continue being green. Then after using Space Sniffer, which is a free piece of software that basically monitors your hard drive disks as well as SSDs and parts out all of the biggest chunks of your data and shows you a visual of how big certain things, you know, certain games, etc., take up your storage on that particular storage device. Uh, what I realized is that my SSD was completely full and I realized that the cache was actually what was taking up all the space. So make sure when you go to preferences in DaVinci, right, in the media storage, and it's gonna be here, so you click media storage, make sure you know what your media storage locations are because the cache, can, cache files can take up a lot of space. I'm talking like 200 to 300 gigabytes of space if you're not deleting your old projects like I wasn't that have like, let's say 10 minutes of content but are cut out of like clips that are about 10 to 12 hours long of gameplay footage, right? So make sure when you go to your cache, you then wanna go to uh, your project manager and delete them if your cache is full or your, your SSD and hard drive is full, right? Because it will not cache anymore if your cache is full. It will not cache your, your waveforms. So this took way too long than it needed, but just so you know, there's an extra step to this if it's not working. If you do the input thing and it's still, and you patch it and it's still not showing you the waveforms, check your cache, make sure that your hard drive drive uh, or SSD is not full of storage from the cache and if you need to get rid of storage get rid of storage however you want but make sure that you have enough room so that your cache can keep filling up with more cache files and can actually cache your waveform so you can edit your dialogue without ripping your hair out anyway that's all uh, like the video please uh, comment to see if this worked for you and uh if I make a new tutorial, hopefully you'll see me again and hopefully you don't have to waste as many hours as I do trying to figure out these solutions. Anyway, I'll see you in the static.